our mission is to help you learn the English language. We have created easy to follow free educational materials for those seeking knowledge of English. Let me hold the door for you, miss. Thank you. You're very kind. Where do you live now? I live in Haitian district where there are a lot of universities. Which street do you live on? I live at number 50 Shingu Street. Oh, it's getting late. I've got to run. It was nice talking to you, Karen. Thanks, Tim. Nice meeting you, too. I guess we'll see just around. Yee, I hope so. Well, take it easy. You too. I don't know why people are just mad about David Peckham. Is there really anything so fascinating with him? He appeals to the fans thanks to two things. You mean he plays well? Yeah. He often scores by free kicks in crucial games. But a football match is by no means merely a show of taking free kicks. Certainly not. What really counts is to play as a team. Passing the ball amongst each other. Dodging defenders. Free kicks are a result of all the teammates' collective efforts. However, a few free kicks often make everything different especially scoring one such goal in the nick of time. In the case, maybe facial charm should be his leading card. After all, the majority of his fans are girls. Yes, his face looks are manly, with a straight nose and infinite eyes. As a man of medium height in the West, he keeps a powerful but elegant figure, looking neither lanky nor stout. And he is English. He makes a model gentleman when he puts on a black suit and speaks with a typical British accent. What are you doing this weekend? I'm going to the movies with a friend. How about you? I'm not sure yet. Well, did you want to go see a movie with me? What movie are you going to see? I'm not sure yet. Is there something you want to see? There's nothing I can think of. So, did you want to go? No, thanks. Maybe another time. Okay, sounds good. Your tie is handsome. Oh, thank you. Your skirt looks beautiful, too. Did your company go union? I heard that many companies in out industry are being unionized, so it's getting harder and harder to compete on a level playing field. Yes, we're hopping on the bandwagon and signing up for the union. Mostly people are pretty happy about it. I guess it depends on if you are in management or in the labor force. Management isn't looking on the labor unions too favorably, I'd guess. I don't blame them labor unions can really put the squeeze on the executives. Sure, but it's probably better for the workers, because the union's whole purpose is to look out for the little guys. The only way that the little guys can take on the big bosses is if they unite. Labor unions are all about getting a voice for the underdog. Hey, Robert. What are you doing this weekend? I didn't have any big plans. We are putting together a birthday party for Mary. That sounds like fun. Where will it be? We thought it would be fun to have a pool party at Jay's house. Oh good. Can I bring anything? We will be providing hot dogs, hamburgers, and cake, but people can bring side dishes. 
I am assuming that the dress is casual. Dress casually and bring your bathing suit. Wonderful. Just email me the time and date and I'll be there. Is learning the English language your toughest challenge yet? Become our student and get access to effective and free educational materials.